base is screaming at the guy trying to catch a pop-up. It's stupid. It's uh, Come on, A-Rod. Well, here's the one thing you come away with. Why is it always A-Rod? Always A-Rod. And if it's such a great play that, you know, good for them and the Yankees got a couple runs out of it, why did everybody in that Yankee dugout basically run away and hide when they asked him the question about it after the game? Run everybody. For, run for oh, they want nothing to do with it. So the Yankee players didn't like the idea. They didn't want it done to them. They ran for cover. Yeah, Bobby in Vegas. He's on yes, he's on the fan. Bobby, what's going on? How are we doing, guys? Hello, Bobby. Bobby. Good. Uh, I just want to say, man, you know, I think it was wrong. First of all, the guy on third was just caught up, and he should know, you know, the teammates got to know each other's voices. And if you play it back, he just said, ah, it's not like he called, I got it. And Joe Torrey did defend him because every player – when you go by the dugout and screaming, I got it, I got it. So I don't want to hear that baseball player. I, I guarantee do that. you, I, I guarantee you, George Torrey right. never did that running around the bases. Guarantee it. But, but players, if it is, if it is, they do it, if they do it, they do it all the time, huh? If they do it all the time, why did Toronto react the way they reacted? Because they were mad. If, he, if the guy would have caught it. What were they mad about? They were mad the guy dropped well, the Well, why would they be mad if he did it all the time? Because because guys do it all the time. No, they they I got do it. it. I got it. They, they don't do that all the time and on the didn't infield. Even say I got it. He said my, he, he said ah. Oh, wait, we think he said ah. I mean, we weren't there. I mean, we think we know he, he no, screamed. If you, play, if you see the we scream. Anyway, you, you, like, now, now you're reading lips. Is that what you're doing? Yeah. Oh, okay. Now you're reading lips. Okay. I'm reading lips. Bobby, okay. Bobby, okay. if if it was such an accepted play, then how come nobody in the Yankee clubhouse supported him? Because they're not going to sit there and go. Well, yeah, I think it was a Why didn't they say good play? Why, Why didn't they say good play? They got Yankees got runs out of it. It's a play in baseball. Why not say smart play? Why not say, you know what? Good play, A-Rod. We need everything we can get. We need to win, blah, blah, blah. Why, Why didn't they hear that from Why, anybody? Why, Why not good stuff going on with A-Rod? They're not going to just go, yeah, great play. No, yeah, they would, except it was, you know what? A lot of people do not consider that to be a good play. They consider that to be a Bush League play. I don't want to bring up Jeter, but you wouldn't see, you know, two things about Jeter, if I may. Two things. Number one, you wouldn't see Jeter doing that around the bases. And number two, you wouldn't see Jeter on the back pages of the papers, married and all those kinds of things. You wouldn't see that front page of the papers. You wouldn't see Jeter doing that. I, gotta, I, I don't want to make Jeter out to be God, and I'm not a huge Jeter fan. And we all know that Jeter's done a bad job of supporting A-Rod publicly. We all know that. But I don't think that Jeter, he's got, you know, he's secretive anyway. He can't get anything out of him. But he would not put himself in that kind of situation. No, he would not. Either way, be he, fair. He no, would not do that. No, he would not. He's single, and he wouldn't do that. No, he would not. That's, there's, no, there's no question. He just no, he it. would not. No. He, he would, would, it's, it, there's no other way to no say it. No other way around it. You know, he wouldn't he, do it. It's not the way he lives. Yeah. Howie and Merrick. Now, I'll also say this. Joe DiMaggio is the most revered Yankee of all time. And you read that book by uh, our pal. And Joe DiMaggio was, you know, he was. But he's single. He, he, but he wasn't, you know, he did a terrible job for his kid. Oh, yeah. Wasn't, listen, I mean, he was no angel lot either. A lot of these guys, no. You see, again, no. that's why you can't get too wrapped up in their personal lives because you know what? The, you're judging them on their baseball careers. We don't know what their personal lives are. And Ruth. Well, some good, Ruth. some bad. And look at Ruth. Yeah. And Mickey wasn't no angel either. Oh, as we know. Howie and Merrick. Howie, what do you have? I have get out of the ivory tower with Mike, with the sophistication. The problem with the Yankees mm -hmm. is exactly what the fact tower? that they Let me finish. Yeah. Let me. The problem with the Yankees mm -hmm. is that they're not backing up A-Rod. Mm -hmm. They're too comfortable. They're too much in their ivory tower. Mm -hmm. So the guy yelled something coming around the bases. Mm -hmm. Big deal. Right. They should have be. They should be applauding him. Well, number come, one. How come, number two. If he did. ever, how come if he did? ever dropped the ball like that because another player did that to him, you guys would be killing a Rod. His teammates would be killing him, and nobody would be saying anything about the guy that did it except, hey, what a well, great heads up play. We did say the third baseman should have caught the hey, ball. Should have anyway. caught the ball.